Welcome to another episode of The Bold and the Beautiful. We open up with Eric Hope, Brooke Carter, and Liam gather in the office at Forrester. Says that Steffi asked them to meet there. They wonder what it's about. They discuss Taylor and Ridge both live in town. Then they discuss uh, Thomas being scarce and his schemes. Eric explains how disappointed he is in Thomas. Then we see Steffi and Finn arrive and tells them that Sheila is alive. We see Sheila returns to Deacon's place and he asks where has she been. Deacon lets her know that Steffi and Finn figured it out and knows that she is alive. Sheila is angry and yelling no, no, no. Back at Forrester, everyone thinks it is impossible that Sheila is alive. Finn says he has proof. Back at Deacon, Sheila thinks that Deacon is messing with her. Deacon tells her that Finn figured it out and tells her to get out of LA right now and never come back. At the office, Carter says it is hard to believe and asks if there is any other evidence other than the toll. Finn explains that there is further evidence and says that the forensic team at the police has reopened the case. Hope wonders where she is hiding. Steffi said that they asked Deacon the same thing. Back at Deacon's, Sheila says that they have a theory. They do not have concrete proof that she is alive. Sheila tells Deacon to stop panicking. While Deacon is getting pretty angry, Deacon tells her to leave. He can't help her anymore and tells her to leave LA right now. Sheila then reminds Deacon not to count her out and said that doing so is a big mistake. Deacon tells her to leave today. Back at the office, Hope claims her dad had nothing to do with it. He has changed. Steffi and Finn says Deacon was shocked when they told him. Steffi says that they will find Sheila and put her behind bars. Back at Deacon, Sheila says she would be proud of her son if it didn't threaten her existence. She smiles. Sheila says she is not going down, neither is Deacon. She promises not to tell, tell on Deacon and agrees that she has to leave. Then we see she and Deacon kiss. We then see Finn and Steffi go to El Jardina to eat. Finn is shocked that she would ever come back there after the shooting. Steffi is happy her parents are out of town. Finn says he can't get over Sheila shooting Steffi. Back at Deacon, Sheila puts on her new face and get ready to leave. Deacon expressed that he will miss her. Sheila thanks him for being a good friend. Sheila vows she won't go back to prison. She won't tell him where she is going. Says it's best that he doesn't know. Back at the office, Brooke wonders where Sheila has been all this time. Eric says Sheila is very resourceful. We end where we see Steffi and Finn wonders what Sheila is out there planning. Steffi says she is going to the restroom to call her mom and update her. She is in the bathroom. In walks Sheila. Steffi bumps into her and spills the drink. Steffi, while trying to help her, then recognizes that a toe is missing. And she realized that it is Sheila. Thanks for watching. Bye.